Tonight we are hearing from the family of Bremen High School football player Carson Kimball. That's right. This is a picture of the teenager we're going to show you here right now. He is recovering after a devastating injury on the football field Friday night. Our Liza Lucas is joining us live from Grady Hospital after talking with his family and teammates. So Liza, there's been a really big show of support knowing Carson was left without feeling in his lower body. What more are we learning from him tonight? Well, this is really a day by day situation, one that is changing sometimes within the hour, and that's how the family is taking it at this point. But at the same time, we've been talking to his loved ones all day, his teammates, his friends, and they say that Carson is really a leader, someone who loves to bring people together. And that is really what's happening behind the scenes. The community joining forces, offering a collective optimism that will see Carson walk again. Reminders to stay strong for the high school player known for his big, bright smile. He's talking, he's making jokes. Carson Kimball's older brother Cole says the community has really come together for their family. After Carson was severely injured after a tackle during Friday's Bremen High football game, the quarterback left with no feeling below his waist. He's doing good. He has a great attitude. Um, yesterday, he could only feel about to right here on his chest and now it's like three or four inches lower. Members of Carson's football team showing up at Grady on Monday for the guy they say is always there for them and never gives up. I know Carson in his brain, he's just taking a break from walking right now. The players say these hard times are already bringing them closer. Family friend Hugh Norton calling such response amazing. And I can tell you one thing about Carson that I know, his one goal in life is to bring people together. And while the road ahead may look long, his friends and family say they know for certain that Carson already carries the faith and mental strength for any challenges that lie ahead. I want them to know um, how Carson is, um, that he's a fighter and he will never give up no matter how hard it gets. And that's what we heard from over and over throughout the course of the day, that perseverance, that drive that Carson already has. His brother says for now, the plan is to stay here at Grady as doctors determine whether Carson needs any other surgeries for the time being. And we have to say, he's only able to hold up his phone a little bit each day. So family members have actually been reading messages that have been coming in and there have been countless of them. We even heard that the video was sent by UGA head football coach Kirby Smart and the family got to watch that. So moments of lightness over here at Grady. Those messages they say really mean the world. Live at Grady, Liza Lucas, 11 Alive News.